So this is just a little bit of a chatty video about the products from Beyonce's hair care brand Sacred that I've used. I am a big Beyonce fan, like she means a lot to me just in like a deep way. <laughs> I feel like she has taught me so much about race issues, gender issues, her music is inspiring, her visuals are like jaw dropping and it's just been a privilege to be alive during her reign. You know? <laughs> I'm a, I guess I'm just saying this because I'm a fan, but I can also recognize that in the past she has sometimes partnered with brands or released certain products that maybe haven't been the best. So I'm not necessarily going into, into sacred with blind eyes, but this project was different. Like I think we as fans could tell that she put a little bit more heart, you know, and care into the release of Sacred. Like this has an actual connection to her. Obviously Beyonce is known for her hair, whether it's her stage hair, her natural hair, her mum's salon when she was a child. Like there's a whole like history there that really makes a lot of sense. So personally, I was super excited to see her coming out with a brand. And I think it's super cool that she's actually not partnered with like a major conglomerate to do this so this is technically like an indie brand of course it's Beyonce money but still like indie brand um, and there's just so much like passion and care that's come into it so yeah let me stop rambling it's just like it she means a lot to me and I'm really happy that the brand that she has brought out is actually made of like really well done good quality products now one other thing is that I'm not really the target audience like some random dude in Australia like whatever like why am I even talking about sacred I barely have any hair it's short I cut it all the time so what I'll talk about is more like the textural experience and how I've enjoyed using them not so much the like results that I've had on my hair because I just don't really have that much hair so this might not be helpful but it was just important to me to make a video kind of highlighting how much I enjoy the brand and I would very much encourage you to explore some of the products because they are properly good quality I'll actually start with my favorite product from the range, which is their clarifying scalp scrub. And it's a shampoo as well. This has a little bit more of like a fresh minty scent, which is really invigorating. And I absolutely love using it. The texture is also quite unique. So it has like scrubby components, but it's still, uh, but it's still like shampoo enough. So you can actually run it through your scalp and it feels like it's cleansing properly. I feel like some scalps are so overwhelmingly like moisturizing that they don't actually clean the hair or they or like the particles in them are so rough that they kind of get stuck in the hair this one they've just designed perfectly no notes i think it is the best scalp scrub i've ever used and the fragrance of it is just that little bit extra special i i definitely will rebuy this it will be like a long-term favorite of mine it gets all of my styling product out it just works you know it works well it gets rid of everything it does its thing it's designed perfectly so this is chef's kiss 10 out of 10. Next is the Moisture Sealing Lotion, which has a little bit more of the signature sacred scent. So it's like a deep, warm amber. It has a beautiful fragrance. So I love using this even just from a sensorial perspective. The Moisture Sealing Lotion is a little bit of a confusing product. Like I assume it's supposed to be some sort of heat protector before blow dry. I don't blow, blow dry my hair or at least very rarely. Um, but I use this as kind of like a conditioner. So when I wash my hair, I don't actually often use a conditioner. Um, and when my hair starts to get a bit longer, it can get, it can feel a little bit weird if I don't have conditioner in it. So I would use this after stepping out of the shower as like a leave-in conditioner basically. But the nice thing about this is that it also acts as a styling product. So especially if my hair is behaving on the day and I don't need it to like sit or freeze in place, I just put like a little bit of this, like a pea size amount in and it just slicks everything back enough. It has a natural look, sort of like a soft, sort of like a soft glow, definitely not shiny or glossy, but not too matte either. Um, basically, yeah, it just has like a natural look. It's actually what I have in my hair now, so I don't have any styling products in there, just the, the moisture sealing lotion. And I think it delivers a pretty natural, effortless effect, which I really enjoy. So another standout product, and I love that you only need a very, very small amount, so this bottle will last forever. Next 
Next is the Sacred Hydrating Shampoo and this has the most amazing lather. It's just like so luxurious. Like imagine yourself at a hair spa. This is what the hydrating shampoo delivers. It's like an experience every time you shower or wash your hair. For me personally, the actual conditioning quality of this is a little bit too heavy. So funnily enough, it's a little bit too hydrating. Um, I'm looking forward to when maybe Sacred expands the line into a little bit more like clarifying or, or shampoos dealing with oilier scalps. So if you have dry scalp, if you have dry hair, really anything to do with dryness, this shampoo will be amazing, but I can also see why some people maybe who have fine hair would find this a little bit too rich essentially. So still an excellent product, an awesome shower experience. The smell is unreal, but yeah, I think this product in particular is a little bit more targeted towards dryness, which is a little bit obvious because it's a hydrating shampoo, but you know, just to explain. And the last product I picked up from the brand is the Nourishing Hair Oil. The packaging is so fun. Um, and this also has the signature kind of warm amber scent from Sacred. Now I have no business buying a hair oil. It's definitely something that would weigh my hair down. I don't need it, but I actually use it sometimes on my beard as like a beard oil and, and also around the kind of sides and sideburn area just for a little bit of softness there, but also scent. So I kind of use it as a hair perfume without using a hair perfume, if that makes sense. So great for shaving as well. So um, as long as you like the sacred scent and I can't imagine people wouldn't, it's super warm and cozy. Um, so I love using that. It's a bit of an indulgence for no reason for me, but excellent quality. And I think is actually multi-purpose in that way. So again, I don't know if this was helpful at all because I'm certainly, because hair is certainly not in my lane. I'm very much, you know, skin only. But again, like I just love that Beyonce has come up with something that is really good quality that I'm sure she's proud to put her name to and her whole family is and that it seems like everybody that's using it really thoroughly enjoys. So congratulations Beyonce and the whole Sacred team. I can't wait to see what's coming next. And this is now the only hair brand that is touching my scalp, even if I'm not really the target audience.